subscribe to our youtube channel and press the bell icon to get the latest updates hello viewers welcome to the fast profits daily myself rajesh patia markets have back reclaimed the 18000 levels in the span of one month where the lows were around 15671 in the march start at the start of the april we are back to the 18000 and it's been the bullish uh, asian indices and if you remember uh, i did a video last week that asian indices are well poised for an outperformance against the uh, global markets and we saw uh, against the dow jones as well and i think this outperformance will continue into the uh, indian markets and india is one of the uh, most outperforming into the asian indices as well so back towards and we are just i would say uh, 600 points away uh, from the all time high and the momentum is very very uh, strong uh, we started the rally into the march with reliance the king uh, and uh, right from around 25 uh, uh, sorry 2180 2185 lows back to the uh, 2650 2670 levels now and uh, that rally was uh, largely fueled by uh, the uh, reliance second leg of rally what we saw yesterday was the hdfc twins which gained over 10% uh, and if i just look at the hdfc from the low somewhere around 2050260 back towards 2900 levels nearly 40% rally from the lows has been remarkable uh, a turn around for hdfc in the last one month and this too has largely fueled the rally uh, towards the all time high again brand uh, with infosys tcs have been Uh, coming back very very strongly but uh, if you look at this st- rally started with reliance and it's been fueled by hdfc now uh, as you have read the uh, title and elephant in the room uh, reliance industries well uh, on the street everyone is looking for a bullish buy on to the reliance but i think there could be the pause and in fact i have recommended in one of our, my product uh, on the reliance long somewhere around 2195 and book the profit somewhere around 2550 uh but now i think that reliance uh, is uh, slightly at a cautious level let's first look at the reliance uh, chart over here this is the daily chart of reliance and if you look at this red lines it's been bearish harmonic pattern called bearish shark and uh, if i just look at the whole structure uh, it started uh, with the uh, strong momentum from the lows of around 2195 to the highs of around uh, somewhere to 6 uh, 60 to 670 where it marked exact 88.6% of xa so that is the first uh, i think is a pause to the momentum second if you look at the last uh, three four trading sessions it's been consolidating or resisting around right at the reversal level which is again a sign of cautious for me and when markets have hit 18000 levels largely led by hdfc twins lang was slightly trading flat to negative in the yesterday's session in the first half uh, where markets were going stronger now i think uh, this is very very crucial and if you look at the bearish harmonics are basically fib based calculated uh, pattern and they are reversal in nature uh, i believe this could be the pause to the uh, reliance momentum and if you look at the lower panel which is the rsi is indicating that it's been overbought zone again there is uh, when the markets or the reliance uh, goes into overbought territory it tends tends to uh, fall If I look at the 50% of the rally, right from around 2180 back to 2650, the 50% rally comes to around 2430 2440. I think that could be the level 2500 to 2450 is the level which I am eyeing where Reliance could retrace. Again, uh, I'm not looking at the trend trend change, uh, but there could be a retracement uh, looking at the harmonic pattern on the uh, daily scale. Though weekly and monthly still tends to be remain uh, bullish, but I think uh, the next leg of rally might not be fueled by the Reliance uh, into the Nifty if we see all time highs. But uh, there could be a pause to the uh, recent Reliance uh, leg. What could go wrong? Uh, reliance industry uh, uh, if you look at the energy index where reliance holds the highest weightage uh, let's look at the uh, chart over here uh, it has been broken out of the rectangle structure over here and uh, the series of rectangles has been there on to the uh, cnx energy index and the recent breakout indicates that the energy index still in, is in a bullish trend okay i'm not saying that reliance has turned out to be the uh, positional uh, biased bearish 
but there could be expecting the retracement where this breakout can be retested now again uh, reliance holds the weightage and that could take uh, energy index to the lower to the breakout retest level uh, but if i look at the one chart which is uh, a very very strong uh, let's look at the cnx energy or nifty energy index to the nifty 50 ratio chart uh, what does this ratio indicate that when the uh, this prices go higher it means that energy index is outperforming against the nifty and when this ratio goes down which means that nifty is outperforming against uh, the energy index now if you look at the whole re red uh, rectangle structure and this is not this is right from 2018-17 end uh, to 2021 first quarter uh, 22 first quarter if you look at this has been into a consolidation zone which means that sometimes energy index outperforms sometimes nifty outperforms they tend to swing into the uh, uh, rectangle structure but now after nearly four years we are witnessing a breakout into this uh, uh, chart which means that energy index is very very uh, poised for the huge rally against and outperformance uh, of the nifty for last few times so this there is a possibility that energy index could outperform in a, a longer scale and again this is a weekly chart so i'm not looking from a, a one two week per se but i'm looking for a six months one years per se where energy index could outperform by a big margin against the nifty as i said reliance holds the highest weightage into the nifty but yes there could be a dip into the reliance where you can look for an accumulation uh, into the uh, uh, stock but at certain at current point of time i think elephant is an elephant uh, reliance is an elephant in the room uh, where no one is looking for a bearish bias everyone is looking for a bullish bias and there i'm expecting there could be a pause or retracements towards 2500 to 2450 onto the downside into reliance where nifty can uh, retrace as well uh, because if you look at the rally has been right from 15700 back towards the 18000 uh, plus levels now and there could be a possibility might be might see a retracement and if you remember uh, if you are following me on the telegram channel i have posted a series of uh, bullish head and shoulder breakout onto the uh, nifty chart which is going very very strong so there could be a possibility that we might test uh, the bullish head and shoulder neckline and then uh, head higher and if you look at uh, the uh, i have also mentioned the target which is as per the pattern 19000 to 19200 onto the nifty so any dip uh, into the markets could be a good accumulation and I think Reliance could be the one which could lead to the retracements into the Nifty as well. So keep a watch on uh, here onto the Reliance uh, if in case if you are looking for a trading bias looking you can look as well short opportunity while if you are looking for a short term trades uh, have long uh, Reliance and looking for a short term profit bookings you can look at these levels for profit booking. Again uh, the negative level is where the all time high was somewhere at 27.15, 27.20 if that is taken out I think uh, the chart structure might change but at current point of time I think uh, till 27.30, 27.40 is not taken out. Uh, Reliance all possibilities uh, to retest uh, the 50% mark which is around 25 to 24.50 onto the downside. Signing off, Bridge Patel.